pretty early on we knew that Rutledge had some delays and I was recommended very early on to get in touch with ESD. As a mom, you know, my biggest fear for him is that he's not going to be included. It's really scary thinking that he, he won't have the same experience that other kids have. When we got his diagnosis, a whole plethora of fears come. Fears of the unknown for the future. Is my child going to be able to go to school? I cried and said, I don't know if I can send my child somewhere when he's not verbal. He can't tell me he's mistreated or if he's having a bad day. I didn't really have high hopes. I thought we were gonna get called the very first day. I actually didn't even leave the parking lot for the full three hours. I had wrote them out a three page paper on his cues and this sound effect means this and this motion means this and they read it and they took it to heart and they shared it with all the other teachers that would be working with him and he made it through that first day and when I came to pick him up he was walking in a line with other kids and I was just shocked. So to see them accommodate him and pull him in as much as he's willing to be pulled in but then give him the space he needs when he's not, it's so relieving but it's also gives hope for the future, that he can have an education, that he can learn all the things that the other kids are learning, but in a way that works for him. I like to keep a good chain of communication between us. Um, and, uh, you know, it might be new for you and it might be new for me, but I think we can figure it all out together in the end. The second time I went to outdoor school, I was going through a few health issues at the time, but I never, I didn't realize how bad they were until I got there the staff members and the student leaders were helping me in any way that they could. And that made me really feel like I belonged in that community and that I was noticed there. When I signed up for student council was a big one because I actually felt like there was meaning for me going here. I signed up last year for vice president and now I am president of Pacific Academy. It makes me feel really good knowing that people care and that's inclusive. Joined the tennis team this year and even though I'm legally blind, I have a great time playing tennis and the coaches are really supportive and the team is really supportive. It's just a great community. The Ninth Grade Success Network is a program that is scattered across Oregon. We all work together to try to make a change in the school and have a more positive impact. I felt a sense of community within the people that I've never met before, never had one-on-one -on -one conversations with, but I felt very safe and able to speak freely in that room. Yeah, you can definitely tell talking. They all really want to make a change, I hope. I felt included when uh, they chose me as a candidate to be part of an equality group, because before we didn't have any person of color. I know that I wasn't just talking about myself only, but I was talking about other people who felt feel like me also. I'd say it's rather awesome to see her thrive and make more progress as a kid. Growing up, I didn't have that. I didn't know that I was, I had a learning disability. They didn't know and check me until about fourth grade. So getting the services that she has now to thrive makes me feel so much better as a parent. But yeah, that's the toilet paper. Who, who's on your shirt? Me. Do you have any friends at school you want to tell me about? Yeah. Yeah? going to be so nice to me. They are nice to you, you're right. Catch! Your turn! Catch! Catch! Hey Zayden, how does school make you feel? Good. Good? What's your favorite Can thing? Can you do it to him? Oh yeah, to and him. My son was in, in a, a neurotypical preschool class this year and we saw a lot of growth because they met him where he was at. I've seen kids go out of their way to hold my son's hand and bring him in into a game, you just see them white on the inside, and you know that they feel included because you can so see it when they're not. He now says, I love you more, and he's just a ray of sunshine now. Instead of being so insular and angry towards himself, he's becoming just happy beautiful child that I know him to be and he's showing it to the world. So I'm so thankful.
What's your favorite part about your school? Everything! <laughs> Can you say goodbye? Bye. Have a good day. Bye. <laughs>